So uh, I'm Greg Taylor, uh, I'm a current NIHR Doctoral Research Fellow and Registrar in Paediatric Dentistry based in Newcastle Dental Hospital and Newcastle University. So I very much fell into dentistry but it has been the best um, mistake I suppose that's ever happened because it's given me a career which I now enjoy, I love working with patients, I love seeing the benefit and the joy of particularly children when you take them from being anxious or you take them from having a trauma for example to their teeth and build them back up and build their confidence to where they were before injury. I wouldn't change it for the world. So this is the Child Dental Health Department in Newcastle Dental Hospital where I work. I'm going to take you into the surgery. So you can see here, this is uh, surgery five where I work uh, on a daily basis. So my PhD was driven primarily by what I saw in the clinic. I'm making, I want to make a difference because I can see these teeth impact children. What is the impact over the whole life course of the patient and how does that affect them? It's a very novel piece of research and certainly we don't know the answer and the hope is that this PhD is going to, to give us that answer and it will ultimately benefit the patients not only just in Newcastle but across the whole of the UK and, and more likely kind of globally as well. So for me when the, the post came out it was about deciding what research uh, opportunities and what research themes and concepts that the universities did and I very much was more focused on the the Newcastle approach which is looking at the health services research and how um, we can improve services for and pathways for children and adolescents. And the university here are very strong, we've got a good track record um, of supporting academic clinical fellows into these sort of funded PhDs. So there was that support from the university, from my clinical team, they were very supportive. I was very allowed to be quite flexible in my timetable. So this is me now, finished clinic for the morning and uh, coming back into my office. So. Um, we're in here today, we've got a few other people, um, so we've got Dave, there's Alan and there's Biz, we've kind of a mixed office here, um, all kind of busy at work. It's the place where all the, the kind of the real thought processes and hard work goes into it. My experience of again working across the, the regions and working with the Children's Hospital and the RVI, there is this environment to support early career clinicians and also early career researchers as well. I'm very fortunate that the, the research opportunities that I've been given within this region to work with other collaborative groups um, between medicine and surgery to kind of improve um, research within dentistry. And I know colleagues from other universities and other institutes are quite envious of the support that we get here. What I'm really grateful for is that there is so much opportunity to take a break when applications are becoming challenging or when research is becoming tough. I can go back home, I can go to my uh, corbage, I can walk the dog along the river in the countryside from 20 minutes to the beach, I can play my cricket, I can go and watch rugby. And taking that step back from clinical work, taking that step back from academic work is vitally important to recharge the batteries. The vibrancy of the food, the drink, the culture. You could just list and name so many places in the North East that I've still yet to explore. If you're keen to make change, and you enjoy variety within your daily clinical practice and daily work life, then research gives you the opportunities to, to cover this. Being in this institute and being in, in the research and academic research environment, it gives me the opportunity to be at the forefront of that. So actually I can make a difference with my research and working with colleagues across the university and across the country and internationally.